PPM TV back with another reaction man oh right, this is a serious serious reaction people we have got ambassador um free palestine part two if you haven't heard this first one make sure you check it out for those that don't know which you should fucking know that i'm a massive palestine supporter i don't care what anybody says i do not agree with land being stolen from anyone i support the palestinians i support the natives i support the um aboriginals i can't even say them properly but i support anybody that that goes through stuff like that it's disgusting and right now the problem with palestine is they are brutally getting tortured attacked killed like nothing they're dying in hundreds bro and it's not right and like the fact of the matter is it's not like i'm not a palestine supporter on a bad day or a Palestine supporter on a Tuesday. I'm a Palestine supporter every fucking day of my life. And people will know that about me. Like when they were going through things before every single video, I was stopping everybody and telling them about Palestine on every video. I didn't give a shit. Fuck my likes, bruv. Like I support the real, I support the poverty, and that's me. He starts the tune with Free Palestine, give back their land. You don't deserve to hang, you deserve to be hanged or what? And give back the land. You don't deserve to stand, you deserve to You don't deserve to stand, you deserve to be hanged. Woo! Brother like oh. How can you be a true soldier when you're sitting in a tank? Shooting that little boy you fight. Back with storms in their hands. Oh, how can you be a soldier? What? How can you be a true soldier when you're sitting in a tank shooting at boys that throw that fight back with throwing stones in their hands or whatever? Are you fucking crazy? Like people everybody says about kids throwing stones at tanks, this ain't a lie, this ain't a joke, this is real shit. Yeah, but real shit, all Israeli products should be banned and we need to be pushing that shit. It's not right. And the thing is, the worst thing is, yeah, that I've probably, I don't, I've probably got something on me right now that, that supports Israel. Everything fucking supports Israel. You know what I mean? And it pisses me off. Yeah, we know the main things, Coca-Cola, this, that, whatever. I know about 10, 20 things, but bruv, Timberland's another thing. Don't be wearing Timberland, people. They support Israel more than fucking anyone. You get me? But what the fuck am I going to do? We go down to my fucking boxes. Have no, you know what I mean, though, bro? Like, it takes the piss, bro. These companies need to stop supporting them. We need to fuck the like, fuck. us stop using the products. These companies need to stop funding the products. That's what needs to stop happening, bro. You get me? Like, it's a fucking shame that I have to fucking go to the shop and be worried about if I'm supporting the death of innocent children dying. It shouldn't. That shouldn't be fair. Like, it's not fucking fair, and it's not right. We shouldn't have to do that in our life. No way. For Gaza. For Father. This, was, this bit was in his last song. If you know why I know the lyrics, that's why. <laughs> Every child, mother and father. Where they see their family get a kill, martyr after martyr. You get me? You like trust me? There's a big difference between a martyr and a terrorist. Trust me. Martyrs they defend for something. They're defending for their country. They got no. You know what I mean? Martyr after martyr. Is 
honestly, these videos, they're not taking... I'm going to be pausing this a lot and I don't care, but they're like this shit here. I'm just letting people know. Look at that. Look at that. Look, that's not fucking... That's not a face of, oh, I want more sweets. You know what I mean? Look at her on the left corner. You show no remorse when you hear their cries. Look. Free Palestine from Israel's crimes. Look, look at them. Look at them. Look at, look at the building that just got blown up in front of them. He's probably got family in there. You know what I mean? We need to start looking at what, what it could be our fucking area. It could be our street. We know what happened to Grenfell. And when Hitler killed the Jews and millions died, Palestinians welcomed you and saved your life. Within six months, you brutally tortured them and stole three quarters of their land. Like, it's fucking disgrace. You not, should have known. No, I'm not, I'm not being calm in this video because it's one-sided. So I'm going to be one-sided and I'm going to say facts. And this, I don't wish death on anybody. I've got a tune that I ain't fucking done yet, yeah? That, that like, I'm just going to do a little bathing on my YouTube. You lot will hear it. It's coming soon. It's just about Palestine. And I'm just, like, trying to remember it in my head before I bring it out. But it might not happen like that. It's a deep tune. But what I'm trying to say is, and I say it the same in that tree and I don't give a shit if anyone wants to fucking say something because I don't believe I don't support death but if 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 them people would have died before Hitler died yeah look at the facts Th there was a few people left um, before Hitler when Hitler got, got killed there's a few people left if Hitler if them people would have died before Hitler got killed yeah then you would have saved a lot more lives in the future with Palestinians with innocent civil people it's like them motherfuckers whatever hitler did to them yeah it's like it should have happened to them because all they fucking did was go over to palestine and do the exact fucking same thing to palestinians and it's not fucking fair and if you want to talk about the world war ii you talk about fucking palestine and what happened after the world war ii nah bruv i'm white british i'm english i love my football i love my fish and fucking chips but i don't like murder fucking hell man this tune's Honestly, bruv, it makes me so sad. That's why I'm angry, because I'm fucking sad, bruv. Because, like, I, I've known this shit for fucking since I was, what, 15, 16, 17. And it's like he's still saying the same shit in 2021 that he said 10 years ago. Like, it shouldn't be fucking, it shouldn't be allowed, man. Let's just go back on the whole tune, people. I don't care, man. Fuck it. I want to hear it again. You deserve to be hanged. Bursting out with laughter, freedom for Palestine, freedom for Gaza. And millions died. Gaza, Gaza. Bruv, these vi watch this video, man. For all my supporters out there, make sure you check this out, man. Look, look at that, like. Grabbed her by her throat and just fucking launched her, bruv. I swear he did. Let me see that again. 
Shit, he's got her by the throat and he just launches her. Believe you think Palestinians don't want peace. Like, what the f look at the land they're living in. It Once upon a time, it was all theirs. Or they're just happy with the little bit they've got. They don't... Bruv, like, no person deserves what they go through. Soldiers every day throwing them out of their homes. When COVID happened, and it weren't even that busy, like, like no one knew about Palestine at the time because, it, like, not many people was getting killed, even though, as long as they don't get killed in hundreds, no one cares, basically, innit? And, um, they were just throwing them out of their homes and making them stand outside, and, like, for days, bruv, for fucking days, like... What happens in the Gaza Strip is not fucking right, man. This reaction is going to be like an hour long and I don't care, bruv. This guy's too much. Big up Ambassador, man. Trust me, bruv. See, look, my man's in his bed going out with a peace sign. Now, look, he puts his piece on. No, no, he don't. I thought he did. My bad, my bad. Singing free Palestine till every prisoner is released. I know I'm pausing this loads, but I don't care. I'm going to be getting off this reaction and listening to it straight away. So that's what you lot need to be doing. You get me? Fucking listen to my one after. Go play the song now, bruv. And then listen to me. You get me? What? Say that again. Say that again. And yeah, I remember that. They burnt their own Israeli flag. That's how Jewish people are so pissed off with this, the concept. Every real Jewish person knows what's going on in Israel. And every Jewish person knows about the Zionist forces and yeah every zionist is a jew but not every fucking jew supports zionism and like when i was younger i didn't understand that and i had a big like passion for like not liking jews but you can't blame a religion on what israel and the zionist forces do like no we have to come hard at them and just fucking them but listen to this listen to this bar Fucking middle. To to you don't have to be Palestinian to feel their pain. You get me? You just need a fucking family and be scared to lose that family and then you'll feel their fucking pain. You get me? Stop being selfish and you might feel their fucking pain. Real recognise real. This shit makes me so sad. That's why I'm determined and just got that fucking spiritual fucking... Oh, trust me, right now, yeah, I can't get tame. When I listen to stuff like this, I can't get tame because it's one-sided and you have to be on my man's side. Have to. Palestinian to feel their pain. Souls that went to heaven happens in Palestine twenty four seven. But when hit the Israel commit these war crimes daily. They, they, they drop bombs on babies, raising their hands on ladies. Like, this ain't fake. This ain't yesterday. 
God, this shit makes me so fucking angry. Bar after bar, he's a killer. Like, I fucking, this tune is getting banged fucking everywhere. Can't believe it took me so long to react to it. Oh, the work's been crazy, man. Boy, it's deep. It's, it's, this tune is a 10 out of 10 far. Guys are under attack. How are children any harm to them? <laughs> How? <laughs> what? It's just an easy question that I just I want. I would like to know that for all you Zionists out there that might get a chance to see this fucking video. How are these children any harm to them? What they got? They they got stones that are like this big, and you've got a tank fucking tube thing that shoots out fucking missiles. That's what this big. Like fuck off, fuck off, suck your mum. Every Zionist out there, go suck your fucking mum. Honestly, blood, come to fucking Oxford. Honestly, come to Oxford without them guns, without them fucking things, and and then act fucking bad. Trust me, I'll break your fucking head, you little fucking child killing murderers, bro. It makes me angry, though, man. Honestly, it makes me angry, and I don't... People can say, oh, yeah, you shouldn't be like... I don't care, bro. These people shouldn't be living how they're living. That's facts. You get me? Bring positive vibes around me, and I'll be positive. Bring this shit around me, and I'll tell you straight, bro, I don't fucking like it. What, 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 what? Bob, listen to these facts right there. Listen, do they fight like heroes? What? <coughs> Does Palestinians fight like heroes? This is my opinion. They don't fight like heroes. They fight like Palestinians. Look at look at all these movies. Civil War, fucking look, all the, the New Justice. Every superhero comic movie, everything is about someone fighting Really, like literally in pal like the same shoes as Palestinians, they ain't got nothing to lose. They they're like the odds are really high against them, and they're just they've got that hero blood inside them every single day, and it's just not going right for them. Like, and that's what he's saying. Do they fight like heroes? No, heroes fight like Palestinians because Palestinians are fighting like heroes every fucking day. Like you lot can say, like literally, heroes want to be Palestinians. Literally, they go to. That's hard. Do they fight like heroes? No, this is my opinion. They don't fight like heroes. They fight like Palestinians. That is literally probably the best battle I've heard, fucking ever. <laughs> They don't fight like heroes, they <laughs> Again, we won. Shooting pregnant women and an unborn child inside. Whew. How is a child with nothing left? Look, look at their homes. How is a child with nothing left even meant to survive? Bruh, like, do you know what? I can't get any more fucking... Oh. Literally, I, I just have to, oh, it's deep, and it's fucking deep. Honestly, hand on my heart, it's deep. I would never, ever... Oh, bruv, like, I couldn't even think about how how it would be living like that. That shit, you, you don't even, you don't even see this shit on the movies. This is worse than the fucking movies, bruv. Like, every single day, second of your life, bruv. 
there's nothing left even me to survive They try to idolize but the truth is on my mind They can fool the blind but can't fool the wise Salud! Exactly, you can say all this shit, but the fact of the matter is, yeah, that, like, it's, whoever can't see that it's one-sided are the most blinded, fucking disgraceful, selfish people in the world, because, like, what the fuck, we see the news, we got the news, and yeah, the news do try and hide it, but how can you hide them saying bare shit, oh yeah, it's an equal war, blah, 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 it's so equal, yeah, um, three Israelis almost lost their life, and 296 Palestinian people died, like, look at the facts, F forget about what they're saying, Look at the real truth of what they're saying. They might be trying to make you think like it's equal, but they're also saying things like fucking seven Israelis almost died and one of them's injured, and then 200 and something Palestinians have died. So look at that part. Look at that part and investigate that part. Fucking hell. Donuts, bro. Fucking donuts in this world. Salute to everyone supporting the fucking thing. Palestine will never die to us, bro. You get me? They can take away Jerusalem from it. They can take anything away from it. But they can't take our hearts. You get me? And all we can keep doing is showing these young, the next generation, the truth about Palestine. And hopefully one day, you know, never, you never know, man. You never know. You get me? They're knocking down statues now. You get me for like that, that hundreds of thousands of years old that we never thought they would do. So you never know, man. You never know. It's getting better slowly. Thanks to us. Look at that picture, look at that picture. You show no remorse when you hear their cries. Look at that. But look, look. The guy, yeah, big ass Israeli, full trained equipped guy with a fucking massive strap on him. A little boy with a school bag, has he got a school bag with him? I can't even tell. But like, I think it's just his jump, I think he's just kneeling down, yeah. He's kneeling down, like, what the fuck, just looking straight at him, but when the guy's like, come on, come on. Shit, two more years left and then, then you'll be lying down, mate. Two more years, you've got two years left. You're, you're six now, wait until you're eight and you're dead. That's what the Israeli guy's thinking, mate. You get me? He can kill you at eight. <laughs> Shit. Well, they, they didn't even welcome. Like, they, obviously, a few of them did because they felt their pain. But at the same time, their land was stolen. It was stolen from them. Which is, uh, which England, which my country, like the country we support. Like, I'm English, I'm not fucking British. I don't support the British. <clears throat> and I will never be, support anything to do with the Britannia, the British, because of what we did with Palestine. We stole their land and gave them a small portion of it. And then we let America give the... The, the Jews fucking all these guns to kill everyone and just but we know the truth man Ev the truth we all know the truth do your fucking research <laughs> Gaza Gaza under attack For every child that gets to rest and sleep in bed, I'll be screaming out free Palestine. Trust me. Gaza, Gaza, <laughs> 
I'll be spinning out free, free Palestine. Free, free Palestine. <coughs> you know the worst thing? Do you, do you want to know something else as well? What I noticed about a month ago is that I used to watch bear people reactions when I used to listen to like bear conscious music, like Rat Man, Loki. Man, would love to see people's reactions, yeah? And I think, bruv, like, then when I was looking at all these Palestine, no one, no one does reactions on Palestine, bruv. Like, why? I dedicated my whole channel to, to showing people the, like, that, bruv, I will support the Palestine flag more than the England flag because I don't support what is going on there and it was England that helped us do it and we need to I need to like try at least support the thing that my country fucked up on you get me and like the fact of the matter is man like YouTubers should be pushing this shit more above like they, they can sit there and talk about like fucking like what let me say to you like, they'll sit there and listen to that low key tune army yeah I've seen bad people react to it I ain't seen one person react to Loki long live Palestine or my man. Hopefully, but when I checked, I couldn't see no one. And it's just a fact of the matter is, bro. <coughs> why does Israel have that much power? Like, I will die before I let any of is any Zionists take any power from me. You get me? So if you see a different me tomorrow, that ain't me, cuz. My free Palestine all fucking day. I'm sorry about this long video. It, you know, like, when, when you see shit like this, some people are just impossible to tame. And I bet if Ambassador was in my shoes listening to bars like that, from, like, literally, bro, he would probably be doing similar things, man. Anyone would. Like, so don't think, oh, you just ruined people's tunes because people listen to the fucking tune. I didn't want to ruin anything. Like, I told you, like, before to listen to it before you hear me. Honestly, man, like, Palestine all day will always be in my heart. Everybody knows that free Palestine salute.